The New, York, the New York Flood Center has on the Upper East Side has big plans for the future and it wants to turn its three story offices into a 16 story glass tower. But people who live around the facility say that they're not going to let that construction start without a fight. All right, they fear a building that size isn't a good fit for the neighborhood. Teresa Priolo has more on the brewing battle. Center East location is critical to the New York Blood Center. For over two hours Monday night, over 200 Upper East Side residents listened as the New York Blood Center laid out a proposal for a brand new state-of-the-art building to be built 10 stories higher than their existing structure on 67th Street between 1st and 2nd Avenues. It provides the Blood Center with a 21st century home in which it can continue its critical life-saving work. The objective, the nonprofit says, is to create a life sciences cluster in proximity to the other prominent East Side research institutions. Our plan is to replace our current laboratory, um, not to expand into anything more than we already have operating. But the community sees it differently. I urge you to think hard and long before you actually support this proposal. I have a great deal of concerns. From State it's Senator Liz Krueger to Councilmember Ben Callos, the community is most opposed to the building's proposed height and what that will do to sunlight on one of the only parks on the Upper East Side. Everyone across the board loves the blood center. They are a staple in the community. They do great work and we actually support their expansion. We want to see them triple their square footage. We want to see them triple the size of their building. Uh, and I think the issue is that the community is ready to triple it, but uh, they want to grow by 10 times. 10 times meaning 300,000 square feet of space. What they are asking for is for the city and the city council uh, to uh, print air rights for them. The fight over precious real estate comes as the blood center pleads for precious donations. Currently, they have only a four day blood supply on hand. On the Upper East Side, Teresa Priolo, Fox 5 News. Wow, four days. Well,